Yo, what's crack a lackin' everybody? We're in Bongo's kitchen today. I got my boy Jad behind you. Here. Here. I was feeling a sweet tooth coming on the other day. It was so bad, I just, I couldn't even handle it anymore. I said, here. Here. I need to make some donuts yank. I'm gonna be making donuts yank. <laughs> With, obviously, everybody's favorite ingredient, Nutella. Why not? I love that. Nutella alert. You heard that right. We're gonna be making Nutella donuts. All you need is one stick of butter, a cup of flour, a cup of water, two tablespoons yay of brown sugar, a quarter teaspoon yay of salt, four eggs, and of course, Nutella alert. All right, step one in making the donuts yay. Turn your oven on to a medium low heat and throw that stick of butter right in the pan. Here. Here. All right, so you want to melt the butter up just a little bit, and this is where the fun starts. You grab your brown sugar yin, and you grab a tablespoon yin. You grab one tablespoon of this guy. Ooh, here. And another tablespoon here. And you know what? Here. <laughs> so we'll just mix that right up a little bit. Yeah, that actually looks blessed. Here. Here, Jada. Bro, that looks up. delicious. I'm up to something. <laughs> I have a tablespoon, a half tablespoon, and. What is this, bro? Just a pinch? Fam. All right, all right. Just a deuce. Just a deuce. All right, here goes nothing, guys. Deuce! Take your cup of water. Here. And you want to let that simmer for a five or ten minutes. I'm the baker's man. I'm the baker's man. While this is going, whatever's happening here, you got to be efficient, all right? You got to use your time wisely. So while one thing is happening, you got to start thinking of step two and three. So right now what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab another pot and I'm going to start filling it up with oil and turning the heat down. So that way when this concoction is done, I'll be able to deep fry my donuts right away. You very smart. So I got myself a pot, yeah. Daddy, where's the oil? Oil alert. Oil alert. Ooh, pantry alert. Here. Here. And here. Here. Turn your heater on. Okay, guys, so this is starting to simmer. Actually, it's starting to smell a lot better. It's actually starting to smell like, like sugar cookies. All right, guys, once your uh, sugar water concoction here, once that guy is at a low simmer, then you can grab your flour and go here. Throw your flour in there. You grab your sugar yi. You mix it up with your flour yi. We're supposed to be mixing this guy until it kind of looks like a dough. We're just gonna continue with the hearing. Make sure you soak up all that concoction liquid thing that you made earlier into the flour. Here, here, here. I'm the baker's man. I'm the baker's man. First time making donuts. So far, so good. Bro, this looks incredible. Here, here, here. here. Here, here. Ooh, yo, Jad, Jad, yeah. give me a quick here. here. Give me a quick here. Here! That actually smells delicious. Let's Ooh! Go. Here. Okay, so you want to ball your dough in. Make it a big thing like that. You want to put that guy in a big bowl and let it cool off for five minutes. Thanks, Jad. Here, here, here. So we're going to put this guy in the fridge for five minutes too to kind of expedite the process here. So we'll be right back. Alrighty guys, so the dough's been in there for about five minutes. We're gonna take it out and check up on, ooh, okay, okay. So it's a little bit colder, definitely not as hot, which is I think the main goal here. It has to be a little bit warm, but not super, super hot. So what we wanna do now is grab our eggs. We're gonna crack them in one by one, but while we're cracking them in, we also wanna stir it in. Here. Here. Mix that guy in. I'm the baker's man. Whoa, whoa, here. Make sure you don't get any shells in your batter because that will ruin your day. So egg three out of four. You still want to throw <laughs> ham with your mixing skills. Yeah, after everyone, you need to go hard again, eh? Yeah. Bro, I'm going so hard right now. All right, okay, now we're talking. Oh, now we're talking. Look at the flicker there is. Look at the flicker there is. Look at the flicker there is. Bro, my wrist is murked right now. But last egg, here we go. Here. Last one. Come on! All right, here we go. Last, mm, last final push, bro. My hand hurts. Bro, honestly, the flick of the wrist is here. Nice. Here. Ah! Ooh! 
Yo, that's nice. Yeah, it's still a little. No! Here! So finally, our dough is done, and now we're able to scoop up our dough and deep fry every donut. All right, guys, at this point, you should have a dough. It should be relatively thick. The instructions say to use an ice cream scooper, but you know, you make do with what you got. So we got a big spoon, which is kind of like an ice cream scooper. You want to scoop that guy up like so. Make kind of a ball. If you have an ice cream scooper, I see how it can be way easier, but here goes nothing. Here. All right, all right. So we got a little bit of motion going on. We're gonna scoop a couple more in there. Ooh, yo, look at that. It floats right away. I Ooh. love that. Another one. Here. Ooh. This one's gonna be a big one. Here. Here. Yo, Jad, tell them what's happening right now. This is blowing my mind. So it's really like, yo, it's puffing up like crazy. It's you becoming kind of like a donut yank. Yeah. Ooh, one turns itself. Ooh, Damn, it was ready. I love that. that. Was G. He's right. like, here, I'm ready. So guys, remember, when you're in the kitchen, you want to use time efficiently. So while these guys are cooking, it takes about six to seven minutes for them to fully hear themselves. You got to use your time wisely. What we're going to do is we're going to grab our Nutella. We need warm Nutella. So there's not much left in this jar, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to hear it in the microwave for like 45 seconds to make it a little bit warm. That way we can stuff the donuts with the Nutella. So we're gonna put the Nutella in for 50 seconds. I'm gonna check up on it halfway, just in case. Continuing with the theme of using our time wisely, we're also gonna make the sugar cinnamon rub that we're gonna hear the donuts in after. So you wanna grab a plate, yay. Grab some sugar, yay. And just hear that all over a plate, here. Also our Nutella is done, so we'll check up on that. Ooh, perfect. Ooh, perfect. So you want to grab the sugar, spread it around the plate. Grab some cinnamon yay that I took from my mom's kitchen. Mom, if you're watching here. Spray that all over the sugar and give it a nice little mix. Here, 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 here. And some more here. And some more there, here. It honestly looks like the sand that comes from that Santa Monica or something like that. It's a little bit more brown, not as white. Check up on your donuts. Yeah. All right, let's see what's going on in here. Ooh, ooh. So I think those are done. It's a nice golden brown. We're just gonna make the bottom sides a nice golden brown too. Hindsight's 2020. We should have used a bigger pot, but so far so good. We'll give these guys like one or two more minutes and then we're ready to take them right out. We're gonna scoop these guys out one at a time here. Try to drain as much oil as you possibly can and then you wanna put it on a bed of paper towel so it can soak up the excess oil. So we've let our donuts chill in the paper towel for a little bit. What we want to do, take each donut and roll them in that cinnamon sugar spread we made earlier. So you just want to hear the entire thing here, here, here. Roll that guy up real nice in some sugar and then put it right on the side. All right, and last donut here. You're supposed to be putting your melted Nutella into a piping tube, but we don't got one of those. We ain't living like that. This is an extremely hard maneuver to execute, you do need a five star skill uh, move in the kitchen to do this. You see how the flick of the wrist, it's an ongoing tactic that you will need to master before you even think about stepping in the kitchen. We're gonna make it look like a piping tube. You see that? You see that? We're gonna rip the edge off here. So you wanna grab your donut and you wanna make a little hole in the donut here. You wanna press the Nutella right in there. Here. I'm the baker's Close them back up. And now everybody's favorite time, it's taste test time. Here we go, first bite. Oh wait. Not good uh, at all, bro. Look at that Nutella inside. Like it's nice and chewy. Mmm, bro, these are lit. Are you ready for these? Bro, I'm so excited. Which one should I take? Which one should I take? I would probably take uh, this one. Do this. Mmm. They're really good, eh? Bro. They're actually blessed. These are loud. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Here, rub Here. Nutella. Ooh. Let's... Here. Oh. Mmm. Banger. Mm -hmm. I love that. Love it. Here. Here. Oh. Here. Here. I don't smell any spices. <laughs> I think. Oh, man. I think you got a a, a tikmon. A tikmon. Mm-hmm. How's how's the dough tasting? 
blessed. I like them thick. I love that. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I had a great time baking for my first time. The donuts turned out blessed. If you guys like this video, please let me know in the comments down below. If we can get 176 likes on this video, I will make a part two with another type of donut. Huge shout out to my main man behind the camera, my boy chat with a J. I love that. I love that too. <laughs> I'm gonna get back to the kitchen because I'm gonna make another batch of these donuts. Thank you guys so much for watching. Till next time, take it easy. It's Bongeezy.